It's Real Twarma Cards Chris, and I'm back with another one. Huge shout out to everybody tuning in this video. And this video is sponsored and brought to you by Redefine His and Redefine Hers. I'm telling you right now, everybody who smelled this, this is the best cologne you're gonna smell. Gucci what? Louis what? Versace who? Best thing you're gonna smell, and it's only, it's on sale right now too. So you guys wanna make sure you go check out the merch at redefinetb.com. It's right here, and it's also will be a link in the description. Today, besides the plane messing us up, we're gonna talk about the five things that I hate about my Corvette. Number one is the brake dust. Look at this brake dust, man. It's everywhere. I literally drove the car probably like 30 miles um, the other day. And look at all this brake dust on here. Look at that. Only 30 miles. So I didn't drive it far. It's terrible. I think they should have put ceramic brakes on the vehicle off bat. So that's what we're going to do. So you guys want to make sure you stay tuned because I got a lot of mods and things that I'm going to change up on the car. Number two. I just think they did a terrible job on this. That's just my honest opinion. You know, I'm giving you the good, bad, and the ugly. So, look at the speedometer right here. Look how clean it looks. The number's crispy, it looks nice, clean, and updated. And then look at the infotainment system. It looks old, outdated, look at it. Just missed this right here. I'm pressing the wrong thing, that's why. Look at it, it looks old. It just looks old and outdated. I don't know why they did it like that, but it looks entirely better in the C8, they should have put, that's, that should have been, this probably, looks like C6 um, technology, so they should have did a way better job with that. Number three, these cup holders. The cup holders are terrible. The cup holders are terrible. Like when you drive and I hit the gas, it slides back. I didn't spill stuff in here before. So you guys, if you get one of these, you want to make sure that you don't put anything open right here. You want to only put water bottles, because if you don't, and sometimes I try to put it back right here, but it's still like, when I hit the gas, it still tips back like that. I think they did a terrible job with that. They need to do a better job. I mean, look at it. You could just take it out. I don't know what they, <laughs> maybe they skipped the part, you know, but I'm going to find some to fix that. Number four. The fourth thing that I dislike, and I, this one, this one is kind of really big to me because I'm I'm very big on appearances and how things look. Is this armrest right here, the central console? I don't. It's like it's wrinkled. It's, the car doesn't even have fifteen thousand miles on it. I'm gonna get on that, get to that later. The car doesn't even have fifteen thousand miles on it. It's already wrinkled. So they do make a new one that you can buy, and they can. Uh, it's like more reinforced. So I'm gonna have to find that. But hopefully we can find the exact red to match the seats and everything because I don't want it to be off because it may be off because of the sun and everything else. So if it's brand new, it may be a little different. So I don't know, we have to figure this out. But also look at this. Why would they do that? Please, y'all, comment below and let me know why they thought that was a good idea to do that. It's, it sounds terrible, it sounds cheap, and then it just slams down so hard. I don't, I don't, I, I'm kind of confused. I'm kind of confused on why they did that. But anyway, the fifth, Last but not least, the AC seats. Now, these seats are supposed to blow some cool air on your buttocks and back area while it's hot outside. My only issue with it is it doesn't blow hard enough. So the only time you can really feel it is when you have like on lady, a woman probably would feel it more than the guy because of the fact that they have tighter pants. Well, I mean, usually, cause you know, some dudes be wearing them tight pants, but we ain't gonna talk about that. So usually a woman probably can feel a little bit more, but it's kind of hard to feel unless you have, oh, we got a beat. Ugh. I've been fighting bees for, let me close this door. I've been fighting bees for the last, I've been uh, smacking bees all day. But anyway, it's like, you only can really feel it when you have them shorts, like in the summer. I know, I know you're gonna wear more shorts in the summer, but you can't feel it. If the shorts are thicker, you're not gonna feel the jogging pants, jeans, you're really not gonna feel it. So I think they could have did a way better job with that. But to be honest with you guys, those are the only five things that I could find. It, it was hard to kind of find the fifth one because I, I, I love the car. I wouldn't ask for anything more, anything less. Um, one more thing that I could have recommended they should have did. They should have let it be a hard top drop top. I don't like soft top drop top. So you should have been able to press a button and just take the top off. That's nothing that I think they should have did. But they didn't do that. So, you know, I'm not the Corvette uh, maker. So I, I, you know, 
each its own. But I just want to say that you did a great job on the vehicle. I love everything about it. I don't have any complaints but those five things. For anyone who's watching this video and wants some of this merch, you see the bomber. This is the bomber, baby. Go to redefinetv at gmail.com. Also, if anyone's looking to buy or sell any property, you can always email me at romeshousereviews at gmail.com. i see you guys on the next one. And I don't, also, one more thing. I need you guys to comment below and let me know what you want me to add to the channel because it's kind of getting a little hard with the vehicles because it's about to be winter time here in Illinois. And there's not many dealership to have many new cars because everything got pushed back from COVID. So I, I need you guys to comment below and let me know what else you guys want me to add to the channel. Because we going and going. We almost at that thousand, that thousand mark, baby. So you guys want to make sure you stay tuned and lock in and tell a friend and tell a friend. Join the Double R family. It's real to Rome. And I'm gone.